Today, someone lived long enough to reach the century mark, but one North Mississippi resident, Miss Lucille Rowland, is just one day away from reaching that milestone. WCBI's Quentin Smith sits down with Rowland to reflect on how, the, to reflect rather on the past 100 years. <laughs> Never in her wildest dream did Lucille Rowland think she'd live to see 100 years of life. It feels great. It's a surprise to me as it is to everybody else. <laughs> You've touched the lives of so many people. That's why your 100th birthday means so much. When asked how has the past 100 years been for her, Roland says one word comes to mind. Fabulous. <laughs> Roland grew up in West Point, where she worked as a cashier at a local bookstore. She says the world has changed tremendously from back then to now. In particular, she says people were more caring for one another back in the day. I can remember that when we would get through eating in the evening, that whatever we had left on the table, it was put into containers, and my mother and daddy and I would get in the vehicle and take it to a family that had a group of children that they didn't have as much to eat as we did. Roland has lived to see the invention of the first car, the first television, and has seen 17 presidents serve her country. But even in the midst of witnessing all of that, there's one key moment in her lifetime that stands out to her the most, World War II. Her husband fought in the war. He was in the uh, airborne, that's the gliders, and when they went in with 550 men, they came out with 138, and he was one of the 38. Roland grew up with one sister and had two children once she got married. When asked what was her secret to living such a long and vibrant life, Roland's answer was simple. Live one day at a time. We were given one day at a time. In Aberdeen, Quentin Smith, WCBI News. Now, Ms. Rowland will officially turn 100 years old tomorrow. Her family and friends are having a big birthday party for her tomorrow at First Methodist Church there in Houston from 2 to 5 p.m., and they're welcoming all friends to come help them celebrate her big day.